Tropical soda apple is the greatest weed threat currently facing the cattle industry in northeast New South Wales. This noxious weed is a 1 to 2 metre high perennial shrub which can easily invade semi-shaded areas such as pastures, forests, riparian zones, roadsides, recreational areas and croplands. The weed is a native of South America and was first recorded in the United States in Florida in 1987 where a 10,000 hectare infestation was discovered. Within five years of that initial discovery, tropical soda apple had managed to heavily infest over half a million hectares throughout southeast USA and has the potential to do the same here in New South Wales. Let's learn from their mistakes and not allow it to happen here. We need your help to find and eradicate all tropical soda apple infestations in northeast New South Wales. Learn how to identify tropical soda apple. There are a few key features which make it easy. Such as the leaves, which are around 10 to 20 centimetres long, 6 to 15 centimetres wide, and the upper side densely covered in small hairs. The flowers, which are small, white, and have five petals. The 10 to 12 millimetre long spines, which cover most parts of the plant. And finally, the most distinguishing feature of all, which is the fruit. The fruit is around golf ball size, and when immature, resembles a miniature watermelon. and as it matures, it develops a bright yellow colour. If you suspect you have found an infestation, or would like to learn more about Tropical Soda Apple, please visit www.looklearnact.com By working together, we can prevent this species from impacting on our economy, our environment and our way of life. Look. Learn. Act. And let's help to keep the North Coast beautiful Productive And weed free